Do you like work in here? Ah, oh, very cool. I mean, cool. my computer's downstairs right now, but this is really technically nice, dude. Office. So you know, guys, Mitch is showing me around. We're in New Hampshire. I didn't really say I was going on a road trip. Most important room. In New the England house road right trip, here. pretty much. The bathroom. The bathroom. So this is shortly after I moved here. My brother got me this for. Well, he had it and he very gave cool, it to dude. me as a graduation gift. It's uh, kind of unique because it's made in Russia and you can't get guns from Russia anymore. It's not allowed anymore. Uh. So. It's pretty cool, pretty cool graduation yeah. gift. And the color's cool too, it's like a red mahogany. Yeah. 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 This was just done like this when he came in? They used to live in here. Oh. So his mom is supposedly a painter. Oh, so. that's pretty cool. So this bike is from China, it was $1,500 brand new. Yeah, wow, man. Yeah, you, you got it like imported here or just? This company imports it. I bought right. it from the dealer in Texas. Wow. And I'm kind of getting fucked over because it doesn't hold fuel. Mm. In the process of getting a warranty claim and getting that fixed. And it's hard. To, it's hard alone nowadays just to own a car, you know. Yeah. Let alone like a bike now too. And I, yeah. Oh, that's yeah. tough, man. It, it's cool too. I'm, I'm sorry. You know, it's like perfect to have a bike up here because there's not much cars. You know, like you can't really have something like that in the city. I mean, obviously you could, but it's just not the same up here. You have like so much space, and yeah, definitely, definitely. Let me yeah. just tell you guys, buy Honda, don't try to save money, buy Chinese service. Just buy a Honda. <laughs> yeah, Alright guys, so Mitch, he took me to Elm City Brewing. Brewing. We're going to get something to eat, maybe something to drink. It's really and cool. This is one of your go-to spots? Yeah, it's yeah. really cool because if you could see, they brew right in here. And oh yeah, I see them in the window. Oh, that's great, dude. And it's like they the do restaurants it like, yeah. attached to the brewery. It even has like this whole outdoor area, pretty nice. Yeah. yeah. Bright and keen. Very this nice, quiet the, town, you know. One of the first places I came to eat uh, when I when you moved you know, here. When I moved here, you've been and you've been here for like six months now, right? Almost, yeah. Almost wow, six dude. Months yeah. Now. And it's great. A lot of pub food, and we're gonna check it out. Hell yeah, dude. Let's go. One short of Lou Gehrig's record of 184 RBIs in 1937. Every question is about something that happened before the 50s. <laughs> I, I mean, you can tell how old they are too. Like, 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 the, like the coloring of it, the, the style of it. Like, what? You should look at this card I'm holding right now. Red Chili Ale. So is that like a hot beer, like a spicy beer? Yeah. Oh my yeah, god. No, look, small beverage with red chili peppers added. Yeah. yeah. That sounds nasty. Nice. That sounds like we're being real. No, well, actually. Are these people crazy? Who is this Rosanna? And, uh, Why was it her idea that. It was the 90s, bro. Dude, how is it, dude? It looks banging. Dude, I couldn't even wait for you to take a picture. I, I know, dude. I, 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 that's okay, man. That's okay. Just dive in, bro. Yeah. Okay. So keep breaking on me. Ah, uh, damn. Woo. Okay. Yeah, there we go. Ah, damn. Yo, so we got the guac. We got a little bit of the guac. We got that. We got a little bit of the sour cream. Yo, no, Sean's not holding back, bro. <laughs> hey, you got any on? A little sour cream. A little sour. Yo, cream. he did a three damn. for. What am I doing right now? This is like absurd. That's a hungry man. What'd you have today? You should save your appetite for this. I had some just fruit for breakfast and then uh, some I fruit? just had stuff left over from last time I was in New York. No, oh, I'm excellent. Like, but did you get pizza when you, went up, when you went to? I got a bacon, egg, and cheese sandwich, that's for sure. Oh, but, but you I, got the bacon, egg, and cheese. Course. Bacon, egg, and we cheese, We had that up baby. here, but it's not the same. No, it's not, it's dude. Not. It's definitely not. Mitch, we didn't even finish the chips yet. We already got... Oh, so it was like calamari, 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 or calamari. calamari yeah, uh, that was actually bad of me to say calamari. Yeah. Like, so forgive me, guys. This is a not good. It's got some cheese. It's got some chili on it. I'm gonna try it. Yeah. Salud. It's probably good. It's really good. It's a, it's that was two thumbs up, folks. <laughs> Got a little bit of a kick. The meat's really cooked well. Um, perfectly toasted the bread. Pepper 
side of cheese, some chips, got a pickle right here too. It's all really good. So Mitch, we just left Elm City Brewing Company. Very good food, very good food. What do you think? Did you have I think it was really good. We smashed that shit. Oh like you God. guys are gonna smash that like button. Oh hell yeah, you better and like it, like that shit, and subscribe. Since we're in Keene, uh, New Hampshire, this is Shallon Eats takes Keene. You know, like so the other ones have only been like Shallon Eats takes Brooklyn, and you know that's the thing. Originally they were all gonna be, uh, you know, maybe New York. Well, originally it was Staten Island, right? Just Staten Island. Then it was like, you know what? We got five boroughs. Let's go to. Uh, the other boroughs, you know? So I, I, I did Brooklyn a few times. I was still going to do the other ones. But, you know, if I'm out of state in scenarios like this where I'm going to visit my friend Mitch and other, and other friends, uh, why not try out the restaurants that are around here? So you got to make it a whole, like, travel thing. Do you see this bullshit sign right now? Look what that says. You want to know why? Because no people pets. have their How? dogs and they shit everywhere and they don't clean it and it ruins it forever. Oh, my God. Oh. This is pretty nice, man. This is uh, Otterbrook Beach, they call it. Yes, this is Otterbrook, Bre Otterbrook Beach. Why do they say beach, though? We're not anywhere if, near a if beach. If it's a beach, it could be a beach on a lake, too. It's still a beach. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Right. Good point. And this park is on the Keene Roxbury line. So part ah. of the park is in Keene, part of it's in Roxbury. Oh. Oh, I see. Dude, this is really nice. Do you ever, you, you've never really been here before? I've or never just... been to this part of the park. I've been there's a dam up the lake. I've been there. Pretty nice, dude. It was really quiet. You know, there were there were people back there having a little barbecue, which was nice. But I'm surprised no one's on the lake. I know, right? It's it's. I guess it's not sunny enough. But the people actually come and swim here, huh? Yeah. Yeah, that's cool, dude. Got a little beach here, very nice. Look at all the scenery, the trees. It's, it's gorgeous, man. We're almost at the bottom already. Oh uh, hell yeah! I'm get, we're getting eaten alive up here too. Lots of bugs. So for tomorrow's hike, we're probably gonna get some bug spray, you know, so we don't. Come numb to numb to it now that I'm like a, a New Englander. <laughs> yeah. I don't even feel it. Sean's like, fuck. Uh, <laughs> gorgeous! It's freaking gorgeous. All right, we made it to the end. Not that far of a distance, really. No. Oh, very cool. Wow, it's been around for a long time. Yeah. Press Army. Wow, very cool. In case a lot of history some, here in New Hampshire. Yeah, if somebody wants a little geography lesson, if you didn't know, the Connecticut River separates uh, New Hampshire and Vermont ah. and goes down, I don't know how far, probably to Connecticut. I should probably drop my camera. Yeah, it's about 113 feet. Yeah, it's pretty easy. Oh, yeah, God damn, dude. You think we'll get like superpowers if it bites us, like Spider Man? I think we'll just die if it bites oh, us. Oh, probably. Oh. It's a beautiful morning in Keene, New Hampshire. Mitch, what are we doing today? Why don't you tell everybody? Make Sean lose his gun virginity. All right. It's not that far from here, right? We're gonna go no, check that great. out. It's a short, like a ten-minute drive. All right, let's do it, dude. And then we're gonna hike that mountain afterwards yeah. too. I don't really have the greatest shoes, but it's better than my other pair. I have a pair of Vans. Definitely not wearing those. I don't know. This is your dentist, bro. No, I haven't been to the dentist here yet. I'm gonna try to As a general rule in New Hampshire, if the street is named after like a tree, oak, pine, elm street, they're usually like a shittier area. Interesting. Yeah, you know, it kind of makes me have second thoughts about all the professors of Pokemon. They're all named after trees. Yeah, you know, maybe there you they're go. They're not trustworthy now. Go to spot for what? I don't know, uh, I guess lounging, hanging out. Hanging out? Well, I really hang out in the woods, but great place to just hang out if you want to have a beer. Uh, I like Lab and Lager, we were there last night. Right, right, beer. Cobblestones is pretty cool too. Yeah, uh, if you're into something a little more trashy, I'd say <laughs> Poor House. It's literally called the Poor House. Yeah, but it's like P-O-U-R, get it? Right, right. Fun. I had a dog and a cat just like that, and it's a little And they're in the crazy. same picture? Yeah, yeah, that's kind of freaky. <laughs> that is pretty that's freaky. Kind of, it's like it's my favorite nice elephant. elephant. It's my favorite type of art, like agricultural. I call it agricultural art, like chickens, farm stuff. 
<laughs> like <laughs> mountain. Hey, you doing good, buddy? Just chilling, yeah. All right, man. Leave you alone. See you later. This is usually a go-to place to get some coffee in the morning, man. I mean, I've been here once, if we're being honest. Oh. So guys, yeah, I didn't mention because I did. We, we took some footage before we were at the gun range, but it was too early, huh? It was like so they, they, they said we had to go back there at 11. They shut it down because there's some crazy sniper guys that have that shoot uh, 600 yards on Sundays, so that takes up the whole range. Oh damn! So they do that till 11:30. So we're gonna smash this, and then we're gonna hike, and then we'll go. To yeah, the we're gonna, yeah, we're gonna go hiking first, even though it wasn't our original plan, but. So how's that, by the way, dude? That looks pretty good. Oh, how are you on there? No. Oh, snap. How would you say it is? What's on there? I'd some say cheese, it's pretty good. So just just some egg, like... Egg and cheese. I skipped the sausage today because uh, I'm vegan now. Are you? How would I be an egg and cheese if no, I'm No, that's vegan? what I was saying. That's like the comparison. No, I just didn't want... I eat too Not eating some meat. Yes, right, I'm right, taking right. it out with that. Good call, good call. I hit a whole house. Yeah, you, clear, you cleared your sizes. Bro, oh my god, you're tearing. Yo, I saw a whole one there. Oh, oh Jesus. So Mitch got the breakfast burrito. They got some avocado on there, some egg, uh, pico de gallo, which is like some seeds and stuff, pretty cool. And uh, looks like tomato, we got some... Uh, we got some sweet potato too. Alright, we're gonna try it out, man. It's really hot though. I'm gonna like burn myself. Mmm. Really good, dude. Yeah. It's actually at a perfect temperature. This is awesome. Um, oh, it's got some cheese on it too. Dude, show them, show them. Yeah, yeah, yeah. See that? Kind of like comes out like that. Dude, it's mad good. Mm. Sweet potato. Obviously gives it its sweetness and then it's got its nice flavors, everything together with the egg. It's pretty fluffy. It's got the nice peak of the gala seeds. The avocado makes it like gives it a nice soft texture too. It's pretty good, dude. I'm digging it. I don't know if I would eat ketchup with this though. I don't know if that's that type of thing, you know. Is but it, I feel like it needs something. There? I feel like it needs something, but I just can't. No, it, there's no sauce. So this is the works cafe, right in right in the, right in the heart of town. It's pretty cool. Uh, after this, we're gonna go walk around a bit, probably check out that mountain. So oh, stay yeah. tuned, guys. Yo, Mitch, I was just looking at that place over there. It says Fritz. That's kind of like a knockoff of my name, Fitz. I don't think I like that, you know? No, it's fucked it's up. It's kind of... Got a lot of churches here. I yep. noticed, yeah. They're nice looking, though. Oh, this is the college, right? Yeah. Uh, Keene University? Oh, very cool. Keene State College, not right, a right. university. You think you would ever go here, maybe? If you had to go back for masters or anything? They don't have masters. Oh, they don't. Otherwise, I would. Yeah, actually. Right. Yeah, you literally just walk your bike here. That's where we're heading, huh? Yep. Very top. Yep. Man, it's gonna be some journey. Walking my precious dog through these cold streets with so feet. Wish I could press fast forward, but I'm stuck in repeat. Ducking police, holding trees in my box of briefs. Passing Charles Deli, I can smell the pets. That's so disappointing. Oh, well. Or bikes, damn. What? No dogs or bikes. They're the two best things. <laughs> Alright, you ready for this, bro? Alright, let's do it. Yeah, am I ready? I did. That is a good pressure. So Mitch was telling me that there's two different ways you can kind of go up this way.
takes about two hours. I think there's a few ways, but I know this is the shortest way. It might be the most steepest, but you know, definitely less time consuming. Also, he said the other way I think takes like six hours, and that's like both ways, right? Yeah, six hours is one way. Well, that's crazy. Feel that burn in my legs that I'd never freaking work out. I skip too many leg days, Mitch. We haven't even walked that far up. I'm already getting tired. You gotta do this more often. Taking a city kid, putting him in the country like this. It's a big move. But I'm doing it, I'm doing it. It's not so bad. It's worth it, it's gonna be worth it when we get to the top. So it's gonna be up up there. I have a view of uh, all of like New England kind of so. Yep. Oh, we're going to the top up there, right? Yep. Oh, we, did. So we got pretty far already, you know, it's just, as you can see, pretty high up. See the mountains in the back, look pretty nice. Oh my god, dude, yeah, I can't believe you even did this. What month was it, like February? It was April, and it was and it was that much snow here. That's crazy. Welcome up north. Yeah, dude, that's tough. You can't see any of the rocks when it's like that. It's slippery, though. Yeah. Oh, oh Jesus. Yeah. That's cool. It's kind of like stairs here. Yeah. <laughs> How convenient. You know, there's like no sense of direction here, you know, there's nothing that tells us where we have to go. I just, I'm... Remember those two girls that just passed us before? They're like, gone. They, uh, they left us in the dust, bro. Yeah, somebody keeps wanting to take pictures. <laughs> hey, what can I say, man? It's my life. It's my job, pretty much. We just saw some two little kids walk by. I mean, hey, if they could do all this, so could we. I think. Decided to take a little break. How you doing, bro? Good. Pretty good. Yeah, Pretty good. dude. We, we we got like less than a mile, right, to go. That's right. We're about 0.7 away. Oh, it's not okay. so bad. Okay. We made it this far, right? Yeah, so. You're almost there. Hell, hell yeah. There. Mitch, where's that elevator? Hi, how are you? Hey, how you doing? Good, good. So close yet so far. Alright, and we made it. Wow, oh my god. Dude, this is amazing. This is Thanks for waiting. <laughs> so tough, right? Take your time though, bud. What's the app for? Oh, it's a, it's a mic. Uh, when I talk to people, I guess I do, I do uh, videos and stuff, so when I talk to people, it picks up like voices like really well and stuff. Cool. Yeah, right? So you, can make, so, you can, so you can make it do a, so you can make it, make you have magic power. You know what? Oh, honestly, I haven't tried that for it yet, but I'm pretty sure it does. Okay. <laughs> Okay. <laughs> no, I know. <laughs> you never went to the top? The top is where we were down there with all those people. Oh. That's, I got there because uh, I couldn't go any further. I was afraid of slipping. Well, the ice is, yeah, yeah. I was like, no, I'm going to die. All right, guys. So we still got a little way to go. Um, I'm going to put the camera away for now because I kind of need both my hands for this. So stay tuned. I'll take it back out when we get up to the top. 
bonus goes. Yeah, so we made it to the top. Well, sort of. So, yeah, we can have that. The whole town, the whole, the whole city of Kings over here. Yeah, yeah, I feel like a corpse. You feel like a corpse? A corpse, yeah. Let's do it, bro. Oh, my God. Oh, my God. I think this is the this is like the highest point. Yeah, this technically is it. Wow. You have to see everything. Everything out here. Where's your house? Which direction? Probably that I think that's keen. <laughs> that's keen, right? Yeah. Yeah, it's probably like when this was first submitted. Yeah. Yo, what's up, man? Should we gonna post up here? Yeah, we're gonna post up here for a while. Sounds good, dude. How you feeling? I'm feeling a little. I'm feeling a little triggered because somebody talks shit about my dare shirt. Your dare shirt? I'm wearing a dare shirt today. I just like it because it's '80s, and I don't know what the big deal is. Why people gotta get offended? I guess you gotta be a drug addict to be so offended by it. Could be a while. It's gonna be a long way back. The weather's perfect, you know. Got to make it last. It's gorgeous, dude. So this is New Hampshire. Beautiful. Damn. Pop. pop. So we're reusing this target that right. was already there. It'll so have to do, it's but. kind of like a, a shitty experience so for Sean's first time, but that's all right. He, I know he just wants to make it go boom and whatnot. He's not <laughs> trying to really hit anything. Yeah, and we'll just do cool. a little shooting. Oh, and if anyone's interested, we're shooting a Smith and Wesson M and P 2.0. All right, full size in nine millimeter. Don't judge me, please. <laughs> Mitch, I'd say this is a pretty great place if you're trying to unwind, get some anger off your mind, you know. If you had a bad day, you come here, think about that problem, and release it. Ooh. And it's done. And I don't think I hit Oh, it. what the fuck? What? Oh. My first jam. No. My first was jam my caught fault? on Sean's YouTube video. <laughs> Wow. What have I done? Sean broke the gun. You see here, I was thinking I could be like John is Wick or something. Is it still filming? Like yeah. Because this is something called, this is what we call a FTE or failure to eject. The way you're really supposed to do it is you look at this right, the very through top, yeah. the, this oh, notch. I see, I see. Okay. And when the white dots line up, you're, you're good. Alright, your turn, bro. I'm gonna do some drills, um, drawing from a holster. So I'm gonna get a little closer. Alright. My holster, I'm gonna do that. It's gonna be pretty cringy. I'm not good at shooting, and I'm <laughs> slow Either am I, man. Clearly not. I, don't give a fuck. I do not think I hit the hole. <laughs> Well, it's hard to tell because uh, there's already yeah, markings exactly. on there. So it's good. It's good. Yeah. Yeah. You could like turn it into like a rave, you know? Yeah, that'd be a little sad. <laughs> yeah, a little. Would be a cool spot. Though. It's just, I like the color of it. It'd be oh, cool man. to be like a rich weirdo who lives in it. Okay, so this is Central Square. It's like the little town center. Of yeah, just in the center of everything. All the food. Places you want to go shop, go eat. Okay, so 
Einbeck, Germany is Keen's sister city, so I guess they have this. Ah, I see. That makes sense. A goodwill gift. All right, cool. Oh yeah, New Hampshire. Two thousand two. You know what's funny? There's some anti-gun protester who's here like a few times a week, and he's always no stand. way. I'm being serious, and he always stands in front of this statue and wow. these cannons. I'm like, fuck you. You know. There's a possibility that they'll try and have that taken down. You know, they're doing that with they've been doing that with statues. Well, let's see. Is this guy a Confederate war hero? <laughs> I don't think so. Doesn't look like it to me. Yeah, look, this is people who fought uh, in the American Revolution. Oh, let's see. There you go. This is pretty much a whole wrap up of uh, being in Keene, New Hampshire, with my boy Mitch. It was great seeing him again. Uh, my favorite part about it was probably, uh, you know, hiking that mountain today. We, we got changed, took showers, you know, it was, uh, it was pretty great. Uh, just got some food, um, and yeah, you know, I'm, this is it for this video, but I'm gonna be heading to uh, Massachusetts now. I have another friend that lives there. I know him from college. And uh, yeah, it's about like two hours away, so I'll probably make a separate video for, you know, I'm gonna be there for a few days, so I'll let you guys know how that is. I'll have... I'll do that, you know, do a vlog. I'm going to do probably a Shaolin Eats in, in, in Boston, too, which is going to be, like, really cool. Yeah. You ever been to Boston before? Never been to Boston, if you can believe that. It's not too here. far, actually. Not you know, at it's all. It's definitely worth the trip. Like, two hours, yeah, about. Not at all, yeah. But, uh, yeah, man, this is Keene, New Hampshire. Beautiful place. Thank you for watching, guys. Peace. Peace.